Hey everyone, this is GMAC Reef, and this is my video on how to use spreadsheets, and in particular Google Spreadsheets, to uh, help you perform maintenance on your reef tank. Now this will work on just about any aquarium, or um, there's a lot of different uses for this. So uh, it's a 52 gallon cube, and it's pretty standard. I mean, I've got some more complicated stuff, um, like I've got a controller, and then um, a lot of stuff you'd find on a normal reef tank, like power heads, a lot of the stuff needs periodic maintenance, like my skimmer and uh, top off tank in the back and just some dosing pumps, heater. Here's a shot of some of my SPS in the tank too. But uh, as far as the spreadsheet goes, um, it's pretty simple. They're just uh, day counters. So they'll tell me how long it's been since I did something, like how long it's been since I filled up my RO reservoir. Now you can see in this example, it's telling me I have to top it up because I told it with this formula here that if it's uh, less than 15 days, say it's okay, but otherwise say top it up. This cell here is just taking today, which is this today formula just is always today. And then these are just normal dates that you would enter. It's this formula says take today minus the last time you did that and then count the days. And then this one says count this cell and says if it's less than 15, say okay. And if not, say top it up. I can just go in and like, for instance, I actually did this today. So I would just say, um, I'm just going to replace this date with today's date and the hotkey for that is just control semicolon. So you can see that goes back to normal and then it'll just start counting again. So up here I mean I've got my stuff that I have to do kind of like weekly or it's just more important. So like we've got some dosing information and um, but down here is just stuff that's a little less important like uh, periodic maintenance on your pumps and stuff like whether you have to like descale them or clean them or just all the stuff that keeps your equipment running good. Um, the cool thing is that you can just um, inspect your equipment as you're cleaning it and then uh, just say, well, well, this is really dirty, so I should probably shorten the amount of days it's been that it'll give me a warning that I need to do that. Or if you're lazy, you can say, oh, well, this isn't even uh, dirty enough and it's working fine, so I'm going to stretch that out. So if it's kind of cool because it just minimizes the work that you have to do just doing stuff that you didn't really need to do. And it's always good to just save a bit of time in this hobby. Aside from maintenance, I can um, keep track of like how long it's been since my lamps were replaced um, or how long it's been since I've started a, a new uh, chemical or whatever it is or like how long it's been since I've had a piece of equipment. I even keep track of like accidents I've had tend to happen in this uh, hobby too. And then just my livestock, like how long has it been since I bought that uh, or how old is my... Uh, so, I mean, you can also just keep uh, track of some notes and like observations. The only thing I haven't gotten into really is this, uh, how to make these um, turn colors. So that's just under format and then conditional formatting. Here I've got it. If the text contains okay then be green but if the text contains vacuum overflow then be red so i've done this for e each of the different cells and of course if you're used to spreadsheets you can actually you know that you can just actually drag them down and they'll they'll copy one another now this one there's just a little glitch here because when you do that you're actually re referencing this cell so you would just need to change this to say f3 and then of course that would work and then you would just change it to whatever else you needed. So hopefully this uh, this is kind of helpful. Um, I've been using it for, I guess, one and a half years, and I've been in the hobby for about four and a half years. So I mean, this definitely cuts down on the unnecessary maintenance and just keeps all your equipment running well too. So uh, then you don't have to replace it as much or have accidents, which is another thing. Anyways, thanks for watching, G Macri.